Yes, yes, guys, here again, uh, here in Banbury today. And I'm actually, I don't know if this is part of it actually or not, but I've been directed here because where I've taken you, that building just there, that is um, a coffee factory, uh, which anyone that comes to Banbury will probably leave always remembering that they smell coffee because it does smell of coffee in the air a lot if you're not used to being from around here. Um, I'm not too sure if this building's still part of it, but they also used to do the birds custard. So I do believe that is the original uh, emblems for the birds factory. Don't know if it's that, is that the company? I don't know birds. It's definitely birds custard, isn't it? And then it says that. So, whatever it is, Alfred Bird and Sons Limited. Uh, during the construction, the original bird emblems were removed for inclusion in these railings. So, they definitely didn't take them up the railings, they left them all the way along. That's pretty cool. I wonder if I can ask him a question. I wonder, should we go in and see? Because I might even have the wrong place. And if I've got the wrong place, then I've got the wrong place. You know what I mean? But I could be right. I'll tell you what, we'll take a walk up here because there is another entrance and we'll see because it might not even be the same place anymore <laughs> making my eyes go funny going across all those that must be going you're making your eyes go funny guys jeez <laughs> uh, I'm going to go down here something tells me this might not even be part of the um, this might not even be part of the factory that I was going to take you to anymore. I might have just been thrown off by the birds on the on the railings guys and again sorry about the wind um, but I'll pick this back up in a minute. So this is definitely the building I was on about. I actually worked in here for a little while. In fact a few places we go today. I might have told you I've worked, um, obviously being my hometown, but I've done industrial cleaning here, yeah? And let me tell you now, it was the worst job I've ever done. Let me tell you now. That was graft. I, mean, I don't mind hard graft, but Jesus. Trust me, it was disgusting as well. What they got there? Oh. Yeah, let's have a little further walk down. And um, there was a fire here as well on the side of this building. I'm sure, it was on the side of it. Uh, probably about a year or two ago. It's quite a big fire. But I'm going to walk round and uh, see if. There's an entrance to the place here. If not that place we were just at at the beginning of this video uh that must be the front and then we go and ask him if i can get some coffee and custard i want some coffee and custard 
I don't even like coffee, but I love it. I love the coffee and the custard. I like custard though. Custard's nice, isn't it? Anyone like custard? Let's go out, there's some. There's a lot going on in this place. Constantly, constantly just pumping fresh coffee out. But I do believe it's actually an American uh, business. But I'll pick this back up in a minute, guys. Anyway, this is around the front. This is the main entrance. Visitors and goods entrance. Oh no, this is the goods entrance here. This is the goods entrance. So we'll have a little walk up here. Just see. It is big, as I told you, look. It goes all the way around to the other side. And that big chimney there, that's usually chuffing out smoke, that one is. But obviously you ain't gonna be able to get much further than these railings. But I just wanted to show you the sheer size of the place. It is big. Um, you got big tankers. Look at that. Huge, huge, huge place. Really old though. This building's really old. I'm telling you here now, it's been here for some time. Got here. Active CCTV. All the usual jazz that they slap on their things, obviously. We got the uh, security guard there, Kipping. Is he falling asleep? He looks like he's falling asleep. See if we can get some lorries coming in and out. That's what we want. Oh, we've got another one of those signs there. Please be aware that your ID may be checked by security personnel. We apologise. See if we can get that. Portion of entry. You're not allowed to take pictures inside the premises so there can be none there is this where you come to get the custard mate so should we ask him should we ask him excuse me mate can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a question? Please leave your offside. This yeah, is the transport gate, not the passport. Oh, okay. Can I just quickly ask you a question? No, no need to be so rude. I was Please, just going to ask. You're, Whoa. You're I'm, 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 health and safety. Please go health outside and safety? the gate. Please go outside the gate. Yeah, no problem. I'm going to go. Is this where you make the bird's custard? No. No? No. Oh. Coffee? Please, you make coffee here, don't you? Please go back behind that fence. You make... Oh, I'll go back behind... You answer my question from no. behind the fence. Why not? Because it's not an information centre. Well... Does it hurt to be courteous? I'm just asking you a question. Please go back behind the fence. Well, don't you, you, if it's private, you should have the gate shut, sir, so that I can't come past here. Please go back behind the fence. I'm asking you nicely. Can I ask your name, please? No. No? Well, I'd like to make a complaint about how rude you've been. Okay, so could I have your name, please? No. What do you mean, no? I don't need to give you my name. Pardon? I don't need to give you my name. Well, you do if you're being rude. How am I meant to make a complaint against you? I was genuinely just asking a question, mate, and then I'd have stepped back behind the gate. No, you step back behind the gate before you ask any questions. I asked you nicely. Uh, how am I going to get your attention if I'm behind the gate? I'm still looking at you, aren't I? No, you, were, you look like you were falling asleep in your chair, actually. Fine. <laughs> you got caught, didn't you? <laughs> Did you get caught sleeping? Did you get caught sleeping? <laughs> oh, fuck you. Jeez. 
Jesus Christ. He weren't very polite. Anyway, nice building. Not. Looks all scabby and horrible. As I say, it's been here for years. Got a CCTV camera there. Um, he was quite rude then, weren't he? <laughs> Do you know what I think? He was rude. <laughs> all because I caught him sleeping. I was going to put that bit in. Oh, he's on the phone now. He's on the phone now. He's just been caught sleeping. Well, he told me to go around the front. So... I was right. That first entrance we were at was for visitors. This is only the good Zim one. So... Jeez. Anyway, so we'll pick this back up in a minute. I'm going to go back round to that front gate and um, see if he's more, uh, a little bit more professional and uh, a bit more courteous, man. I don't, listen, I only wanted to ask him a question. I'm sure they do make the custard. I'm sure they do. I'm sure he's lying to me. But listen, I'll, uh, I'll pick this back up when we get round the front. So, I'm walking back round the front. Just picking him back up, as I say. It's a big place. Quite deceiving, actually, just how big it is. I must admit. Be interested to know how many employees work there. I've actually got a friend who works here. Worked here for quite a long time, actually. But yeah, he's literally walking back round the front. Well, I'm just going to ask him what it is they do make here so I'll get it right. I thought they made Bird's Custard as well as it being a coffee factory. I'm obviously wrong, so I'll go and ask and see what it is exactly they do manufacture here. So, again, be back round the front in a sec. So, here we are, back round the front. Visitors. I'm a visitor. Right, where do I go to get round the front? I'm gonna go in and ask him. Because obviously the other guy got all really arsy with me. So, let's we'll see if we can have a conversation. Normal conversation. Hi, right, mate. Okay, yeah. Visitor, visitor here. Yeah. I just spoke to your colleague. Yeah, you're not a visitor. And he was. Well, no, I am a visitor. I am. I've literally just come here to ask a few questions. No, I'm doing a video for my. From what do you mean? You just Can you at least hear me out, please? Sorry, not today. But what do you mean, not today? Why are you guys so rude, man? I needed your help. Question, be one minute. So now they're on the phone like I'm doing something wrong. I've come to ask a question. I just want to know what it is they manufacture here. As as I say, this is oh, didn't notice that there. Always get the flags in. Bit dirty that one. Bit dirty and a bit tangled. It is dirty and tangled. Oh, look, it's even flying for us. Da, 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 da. Look at that. Love that. At least it's not ripped. It might be a bit dirty, but at least it's not ripped. Anyway, I'm going to ask you, see if he'll answer a question for me. Can I ask you one minute? Give me one minute of your time, sir. Just one minute of your time. All I was doing is for a vlog, right? All it is is I'm going around local businesses. This is the only one that I'm not too sure. I know you do coffee, but do you still do the birds uh, custard here as well? I think birds custard would be one of Just do coffee. Just coffee here. Just solely coffee. And do you know how long this place has been running for? Since 1964. 1964. Mate, that is all I wanted to ask. That's all it was. A little bit so of information. We've done about three times, but it's all over the internet that this, that, and the other, so we don't let anybody pass the bags. That's okay, well... Has anyone told you when they've been here three times about the uh, Section 33? Well, 
of the uh, Criminal Justice Act due about a uh, public right of way. So basically, because because your gates are open, yeah, because your gates are open, and certainly when it says visitors, uh, and your colleague has actually directed me here and told me to come here, and then I've come here and you've yeah, kind of approached me with a bit of a hostile thing. Yeah, but you're not a visitor. We've got visitors. I, if I've we come here and I've got, too. yeah, but if I come here and I've got some information that I'd like to ask about your company, right, at least, like, it, sorry we can't answer no questions, but when you come to the window barking orders and kind of sat telling me that I'm not allowed to be in here when actually I am under that law because those gates are open, me walking in, and then even if you wanted to say that I was trespassing, it would be a civil matter, not a criminal matter. So if you were going to phone the police... Um, I'm just trying to say it would be a bit silly, but I wasn't here for any kind of like argument with yourself or your colleague actually. Your colleague was a lot more aggressive than yourself. Yes, but um, you've been done so many times by people saying. Well, I don't know that, mate. I genuinely come in here, so right? Yeah, just because I, this is my hometown. Is, we don't close the gates, then the gates don't close because it's a 24 7 entrance in and out of here. Yeah. So that's why we can't close the gates. Okay. But it doesn't mean anybody like yourself has given you free public access to come here. Well, I, like I say, you're right. Well, past there it doesn't because I can't physically get past there, you see. And also, but here. are filming through the glass. You know what I mean? With, with the camera. Yeah. You know, I mean, who gives you the right to do that? To be filming me? Well, it's, it's, publicly, it's publicly visible. Even if I stand outside those gates, I can still film in here. Um, as much as I've got no interest in filming in here and it was the building, obviously I'm just trying to t t let you know that, that that's all it was anyway. Like, it's nothing big. I was just coming here to ask you. I know somebody that used to work here and I knew at the time, I think he used to do the custard, uh, the bird's custard as well. And as I say, all I do is I go around with business, local businesses and things, right? And just get a little bit of information. We just get a little bit. We jump on it first and call it. All the map stand down there, as I said, that's why we didn't do anything before, yeah? No, I don't even need that, to be honest, mate. All it was is there's a few things that I was going to put up about the business and I didn't want to give my viewers false inf uh, like misinformation. That's all it was. It was no more than that, you know what I mean? I was just literally coming to ask that question and then I, I was going to bugger off. But I went there because I didn't think this was part of it anymore. So when I went the other side and he started barking and getting a bit aggressive with me, I, he turned and said, no, the visitor's side is that side. And I said, are you sure? And he said, yeah. Which is why I've approached. That, 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 if you see, I didn't come in at first. I was stood here about 10 minutes ago, weren't I? And I didn't come in. Yeah, and the only reason I didn't come in was because actually I didn't even think this was right. part of the business. What? I'm, I'm Mark, I'm GSM. Hiya, mate. Um, is it alright if we just step out? Yeah, yeah, look, listen, I've, I've got the information I need now anyway. Just lower the camera down for me. No, you? no, I'm allowed to record, mate. But as I say, I've got the information I need, I think, unless you can help me anymore. It was just simply to ask... Um, this is my hometown. Okay. I'm going around local businesses today, yep. uh, trying to get a little bit more information on the ones that I'm not too Move familiar with. Obviously, this is a big famous place. Like, yep. when people come to Banbury, people that aren't from Banbury turn and say, oh, the first thing I smelled was coffee. So I thought it was an interesting one to come and do. Um, can I, can I, we're in public, mate, honestly. You've got a mask on anyway. No one's going to recognise you. Um, and all it was was to come in. I know that you do coffee. But I know that you, at one stage, I'm sure, maybe I'm wrong, used to do the bird's custard. So all I was doing was coming over. Like I said, I did come here first, but I looked at this gate and thought, that looks like a different building from that one. Okay. So maybe this isn't where I need to be. So I walked around and see that you've got a little security booth there, which was definitely for that building. When I've approached there, he's been a bit like, uh, I tried asking him the same as I've asked him. I'm literally here to ask two questions and then I'll go, it's for a vlog. He's directed me here and told me that this is the guy that would be able to give me the information I need. Um, I've then come here and he's again approached the window and oh, get the back out there, rah, rah, rah. Yeah, and all I wanted to do was genuinely ask two questions so that I can put this video together about local businesses in my area. That was all it was, mate. That's all it was. In fact, it would have been even a bit of promotion for it because I've got quite a few subscribers. So, you know, and that's all it was, mate. That's all it was. And as I say, we were just finishing off this conversation with uh, your colleague there, yeah. where I'd obviously just said to him the same thing. And just as you walked round, I was about to leave anyway, mate. So that's all it is. That's all it is. Do you know how long this has been going for? Right about before I started. Yeah. Are you quite high up there, management? I'm one of the managers for the facilities company on the side. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay.
But that's all it was, mate, honestly. No, that's fine. Um, I totally get it. Um, from our point of view, um, when you've got someone walking up, holding a camera up, yeah. um, it kind of, people start to worry. So, uh, maybe... What, worry about a camera? Why would you worry about a camera? Well, Quick question. So I ask, I ask this question a lot when they come out with that. What, what, what is it about a camera that kind of puts the fear of life into people? Um, it's, not, it's not putting the fear of life into people. It's just that uh, some people don't like being filmed um, for various reasons. Yeah, yeah. And, um, to be honest with you, that's something that you would expect for someone to be able to walk up and say, I'm putting this together. Do you mind? Yeah. And then we could either help you out if we, if we can. Yeah. To, do, um, do you, does this place have like a press office or something like that that you can contact? You can, you can um, write into um, JDE and they'll be able to direct you to where I need to They'll be able to get me to where I need to be, yeah. Do you know whether they'll be likely to answer any questions about the, if I if I shot some questions? Um, I'm sure they would be as helpful as Obviously, it's not to shine it in a bad light in any way. It would just be uh, we've got general tonight, information. So we've got tonight, I'm sure it would be um, quite helpful. Spot on, mate. No, lovely. Thanks. Cheers. Thanks for your time. Cheers, Thanks buddy. Like Thank you. Day, and yeah. you, mate. So, guys, there we are. That gentleman was lovely. That's why he's the manager and the other two are security, I guess. No offence to any security out there, but... So, there we are. Welcome to JDE. Jacobs, Dow and Egberts. Um, they used to do the birds custard, but not anymore. Damn. I ain't getting no custard today, guys. Anyway, on to the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, much love. Thanks for the support and peace out.